another really fun one is where you just press against the wall and you tell your voice, you go, one, two, three, four. I know that uh, about your passion as a voice artist and your background studying different dialects. So like to begin with, I was wondering if you can give me some advice on how to prepare speaking for this kind of junket interview. Breathe. Breathe. You need to breathe. Okay. You need to, in your, in your guts, you have to make your tummy as fat as possible. Another really fun one is where you just press against the wall and you tell your voice, you go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and it like opens up your, your breath and your sounds. I'm sticking in the breathing right Okay. <laughs> that's just, that's just like, you know, yeah. that's stop A. You know what I mean? There's a lot of stops on this awesome. bus. Thank um, you. Well, I know about uh, your accomplishment as a screenwriter and I want to know when you read Tom McCarthy's script and you realized it was a true story, how did you react to that? I'm such a huge fan of Tom McCarthy. Yeah. In fact, um, as a filmmaker, I, I admire him in many ways. I have my editor, er, I poached his editor to be my editor. <laughs> um, I love his uh, work. Uh, but when I, when I read that, even just knowing about this movie and then seeing that Tom had written it, I was already in, you know. Um, I think Brenda being this character who, you know, in a sea of male characters, the female character can often be left to the sidelines or be a doting woman or just um, a wife or a pretty thing on the side. So this is very much a, a fully realized, um, tough, direct, um, earnest woman. You've been working with John Hamm on uh, Children's Hospital and you guys have been friends for a couple of years. Yeah. Working with uh, with John, what, what was that like? I think the cool thing about working with somebody that you know is that there's a built-in relationship. So to have a built-in friendship, there's an ease and a, um, you know, there's a security there where you can then experiment and you can sort of okay let's let's push the limits let's see how angry I could get her let's it's a safe place to play um, and then if you do want to improvise a little bit you understand each other's um, comedic musicality so th that, that's what's nice about it.